Hey pretty hustlers, welcome back to the channel. So I'm here with yet another video. If it's your first time coming over to my channel, my name is Deanna Marguerite, aka Miss Pretty Hustler. I hope you will love what you see. You want to join the family and you hit that subscribe button down below. You also hit that bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming uploads. You definitely don't want to miss out. So, um, and also thank you so much for my new and old subscribers for coming back and supporting my channel. So today's random question of the day let's see um hmm what is your favorite style of food like do you like jamaican food um korean food indian food american food um for me my absolute favorite would probably have to be um italian food I just love pastas, which is my problem because pastas is very fattening. So I really try to, um, if you have any like recipe alternatives for me that taste very, 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 very similar to the original, please let me know. Um, I really, really love pasta. So, but it's very fattening, the sauce and all of that stuff. I did start to use like wheat, um, noodles and stuff like that like brown noodles and things like that so um those taste okay but i know that there's probably other things that i can do um to really spice it up and then still be semi you know healthy or whatever so yes that is my downfall but that is my favorite style of food i love italian food so let me know down below what your favorite style of food is so today's video is going to be on some um, replica items that I received. Now, if you are not a fan of replica items, definitely just go ahead and click off the video. You know, it, it is what it is. It's a replica video. Um, yeah, so yeah, I did receive two particular items. One is a handbag and another, uh, the other item is a pair of shoes or a pair of boots so I did get a Chanel replica bag and this is the actual packaging that it came in and I did open this already so the contents are like kind of all over the place but I'll let you know um it was wrapped in the Chanel um logo strip thing what is this a ribbon yeah ribbon with the Chanel on there so that was cute to have um, and then it did come with the Chanel satchel bag so it just looks like this and this is pretty good quality here as well so that the bag actually came in there and it was wrapped really really nicely and this, oh, by the way, um, all of the seller's information, I'll just leave it down below. I'm not going to leave links, um, but I am going to leave their information down below so you can have that. Um, but yes, here is what it looks like. So I was really, really, really impressed with the quality of this bag. Um, just off rib, I wanted to save everything else for um doing it on camera with you guys so i'm just gonna go ahead and take off all of the other stuff we'll see how the strap looks and all of that i'm just gonna take a pair of scissors and just open it up but it's packaged really 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 nicely um everything came dhl and um they just did a really good job with making sure that nothing happened to this package while it was being sent so Okay, so I feel like it took forever for me to get that off, but um, that's fine. It just took, or it was just, you know, going to protect the strap, so that's fine by me. All right, so here is the actual strap on this unit, or this unit, this actual purse. And you can wear it long ways, of course, and, you know, just kind of wear it like that if you want to wear it, like, longer or, you know wear it just as a handbag so it has the nice um pocket in the back you definitely can fit your phone in there if you have um if you have like the iphone max uh, it's not gonna fit but i would just fit you know maybe just some i don't know maybe just like a, a perfume or something like a roll on perfume or something like that in the back 
and then you open it up it had this protective layer over top so they are making sure that this bag is not doing gonna go anywhere so there is a little section here there is a little section here for um oh it doesn't even it's not functioning so yeah i'm not sure if the actual bag has that but so it does have the cc's there and you open it up it has the packaging inside it has um the chanel card in here um with the number and everything and then it does have The little Chanel card that comes with every Chanel bag. Um, so this is looking pretty good and dead on one. So yes, it is. It feels really, really good. It does feel like genuine leather. I'm not sure if it really is, but there is a compartment here, a compartment there, and it does have inside where you can fit like credit cards and things like that. So and then there is. Um, yeah that's all the compartments so there's one right in the front the main compartment right there and then the credit cards and then you have the actual little slit in the back for whatever you need but yes overall it's looking really really good i like it so it does have the turn when you open it up that way but i really like this so as you can see it's what it looks like on the side and front again and here is the strap so really 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 cute i like this a lot this is definitely going to be something that i wear just on like more special occasions for me um so the next item is fendi boots so this is the box that it came in these were actually packaged really really nicely as well um in, in the dhl box <laughs> So each boot, um, it does have kind of a factory smell for sure, um, but each boot does come in its own little individual plastic wrap. Um, these are in a size 40. Um, I thought that was European size for 10, but these fit me perfect and I wear seven and a half, eight. So um, yeah, just keep that in mind. But yes, here is what it looks like. The hardware on it is silver and I think the actual authentic ones hardware is gold um, if I'm not mistaken but yes here's what the bottoms look like just like that but the quality of these are really really nice um, they they feel very um, sturdy like they're gonna be nice in these winter months I really wouldn't wear something you know these nice in like the the snow that we get here so i wear my like you know little ugg boots or whatever in the in the um snow but these are really really cute just to pop out in i like these a lot the sh um the actual straps i'm not i think these are obviously lower quality straps um than the actual authentic um fendi boots but these aren't horrible at all either they're not unraveling they're really nice quality but I believe the ones that are authentic are thicker. So yes, the only differences that I could uh, see obviously was the bottom. Um, I'm not sure if um, the authentic ones do have this type of bottom. But it does say Fendi right there. And um, the size or whatever. And then also um, the hardware is different. I believe it's gold on the, on the authentic. And the actual shoe strings are a little thicker. But everything else looks very much dead on. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm really excited to try these uh, out and wear those. And just, you know, it is what it is. But, um, let me know how you guys feel about these items. If you have the authentic ones, let me know if you see any major differences at all. Um, me personally, you guys know, I'm, I'm a straight up hustler. So, it is what it is when it comes to these type of items. Um, I am not like super, I have to have the authentic of everything. You know, once I get to that, 
level and the thing is the problem is a lot of people are fronting out here in these streets and making it seem as though they are authentic and they are not so the fact that people will get online and literally just say that it's a replica i would rather just be authentic and just say it's a replica it's a replica okay so yeah but let me know how you guys feel down below in the comment section um how you feel about these i like them i really do so when y'all see them y'all it is what it is it's a replica but but yeah i will see y'all in my next video stay pretty stay hustling and i will see y'all later Deuce.